So we just got to the Black Oak Casino for the PV Regional, and I'm bowling two-handed. I've been bowling two-handed for two weeks. I'm not too confident going into this. It's my first time bowling two-handed on a sport pattern. So let me top seed, watch. Let's see how this turns out. We're crossing with the Robert Smith today, so that'll make for some good content. Hopefully one of us makes the cut.
Another sad tournament for us. We're in the infirmary after the war. We'll be Don't back worry. next time. Yeah, we'll be back. See you guys in Vegas. So I finished 29th, which is not that good, but overall, all things considered, I've been bowling two-handed for two weeks. I averaged 190 on a sport pattern for my first time ever bowling on one. I think I did pretty good. I missed like 70 pins worth of makeable spares, so that's something I need to work on, obviously. But the biggest thing that I noticed is that every like once in a while, the ball would come off my hand with an end over end rotation and it just wouldn't hook. So I'd have like two or three strikes in a row and then I'd leave a bucket or a washout because the shot was overall like online, it was going in the right direction, but the ro rotation was just two end over end and it wouldn't hook. And that cost me probably 100 pins for the tournament too. Cause I would throw a double, then I would leave a washout open, throw a strike again. If I strike in between those strikes, that's another 40 pins. Instead I open because a stupid rotation. So I just need to figure that out. I need to figure out some consistency. And I think it's gonna be a lot better for me in the long run. It was fun bowling with you, Robert. Uh, let me know in the comments if you wanna see a video of just Robert Smith bowling. Because he had a pretty good tournament. He ended up making the cut. So yeah, let me know. I guess that's about it for this one. See you guys next month in Vegas.